I feel like having a, a strategic plan, knowing the prime time hours to post things online, uh, knowing when to tweet, when to ignore, when to uh, put a video up, and establishing your brand. I talked about admiring Michael Jordan. Michael Jordan, in my opinion, is the person who has made everybody talk about their brand now. I think everybody thinks they have a brand. Some people don't. But the fact that you establish the difference between who you are from your 9 to 5 versus who you are in your lifestyle is significant. So I think having a brand is important. If you look at Michael Jordan back in the day, he had his Air Jordan line, but then he also had his brand. So he had guys like Eddie Jones, guys like Ben Baker, guys like Derek Jeter, uh, Roy Jones Jr., who uh, had were part of his Jordan brand, Ray Allen as well. And they wore his apparel. They wore shoes that were designed specifically for them. Um, and I applied that same strategy in how I exhibit myself online. So in addition to reporting and having close-ups with certain people, you're also doing things like uh, Scoop's Mood, which is an encapsulation of things from my childhood, whether it's Jada Kiss and Allen Iverson and their Reebok commercial rapper, whether it's uh, NBA 2K old videos back when Iverson was on the cover during the Sega Dreamcast, um, and then uh, gaming videos that Manny and DJ Manny L put together, and then Scoop B Radio, which is, which is an extension to uh, the brand that I do, unreleased. Uh, interviews that I've done with people. You know, I had a whole bunch of audio tapes back from when I was a child uh, hosting that Slamming Planet that were just sitting in the Timberland box at my mom and, and my dad's house. And we digitized all that stuff and we put it into a format using radio drops from celebrities that I've interviewed um, and, and putting those things into motion. You can check that out at scoopyradio.com. Shameless plug. But I think that an extension of or your brand, people want to deal or follow someone that they can relate to. And I think that expands outside of just socioeconomic status, race, color, creed. It's, if you're interested in something and somebody else is interested in something, you're able to connect. And I think building your brand is, is just so important. I don't care if you're the president of the United States, you're the president of the board, or you're just a guy working in a studio uh, or on a soundboard. People want to know that you're relatable. So being, quote unquote, that guy on social media is cool, but you want to have style as well as substance. And I think that I bring, with the help of my team, uh, both of those things to the table.